And what are three emerging Kubernetes tools that you're keeping an eye on? There's a lot. I think everybody knows there's a lot of tools that uh, that come out and seemingly a new ones every week these days in Kubernetes, but three that I have in mind. Uh, one is Cube Resource Orchestrator, or Crow for short. This is a tool actually that AWS open sourced at KubeCon last year, and it helps manage and coordinate Kubernetes resources, things like deployments, services, config maps, even resources that may represent cloud infrastructure. And it does it in a more uh, smarter and automated way. This kind of is a, is a throwback to what we uh, codenamed the project internally, but it acts as a conductor for your Kubernetes resources. It understands relationships, creating them in the correct order, verifying successful deployment, handling rollbacks, and say a real world example, let's say you need to deploy you know, a full application. You might need a database, an API server that connects to it, a web front end. The orchestrator would handle all of that, deploy the database, make sure it's ready, deploy the, the server once it's healthy, deploy the front end, and it does that all in the correct order. So we, we open source that. Uh, we have interest from other cloud providers outside of Amazon as well, who have started to um, work together on that project. And this is one we're really exciting about and even considering donating to uh, to the SIG cloud provider in the Kubernetes project. So another one, and I don't know if it's necessarily fair to call this one emerging anymore. Uh, it's pretty close to becoming the new standard for compute management in Kubernetes. But another, another one is Carpenter. And this is another project that AWS open sourced uh, a couple of years back. And it was built to address challenges of traditional VM auto scaling in Kubernetes. I think you know, bringing your, your auto scaling groups and traditional cluster auto scaling worked in the early days of Kubernetes because that's what people were used to. But we took, took a step back a few years ago and said, could we solve some? Thank you.